today on this 2009 Dodge Grand Caravan where we're going to install the timber and suspension enhancement system, part number DVRRT. For clarity, we already took off the tire and wheel and you can see all the suspension components right here. And what's going to happen is that timber and component is going to actually replace this part right here and to replace that part, what's going to happen is we have to lower the axle itself, this whole assembly, down a little bit so we can get the spring out. What we're going to do that is we're going to first take off this bolt for the shock mount let the whole uh, axle assembly come down. And then also, we're also going to undo this brake line here and the bracket underneath it so we have plenty of room to come down and not stress the brake lines. Now we've got plenty of working room. All right, we got the suspension fully extended now. You can see our shock is loose. All right, so we're going to push down on the axle itself and then just give us some more working room to pull out the spring. There it is. All right, what we're gonna do next is go ahead and just take out the assembly. This whole this plastic cup on top here actually has like a little plastic, not really snap, a lot of little angles that just kind of hold it in place. But we're just gonna take a, a pry bar and just kind of just work away around it and pop it loose. Okay, I put a spring to the side now. And this bump stop here is a friction fit on the inside. We just simply pry that out. All right, just give you one comparison here to show the original and the timber product. And this one is already assembled. Uh, it's got three components. Obviously, the spring itself, this rubber component, which fits into the, the cup, and the nut and bolt assembly that's on the inside. Three, so it's a simple matter of just pushing this back in there, and it's going to be a friction fit too. So it's going to be a lot, seems like a lot tighter fit than the original, so it would be a good idea to lubricate this with some uh, soapy water or something like that shove it into place. Basically we'll go ahead and reassemble this back into our spring now and reinstall the spring on the van. At this step, we can go ahead, we got our spring in, we can just start reassembling our suspension, really. We move the axle back up, reattach the shock absorber, and then we'll go onto our line, rebolt that into place. All right, with just one side done, we'll go ahead and move on to the other side and do the same exact procedure. Do one more comparison. All right, and there you have it for Timberin Suspension Enhancement System, part number DVRRT.